Good day. <laughs> Thank you, kind sir. <laughs> New D&D game, but everybody plays as an Oblivion NPC. <laughs> we have to roll to see if our conversations stop. <laughs> that won't be maddening at all. If you get a net 20, you can actually finish the conversation. Yeah. Anything less though, and you cut off most of the way through. And if you run into anybody who like could potentially use information you're gonna give them poorly, you have to roll a will save or like start talking about it immediately. <laughs> <laughs> Super still. You have a natural will save bonus of one. <laughs> and enemies can always overhear you from any distance. Also, they can bribe you and you have no choice. <laughs> <laughs> or they can just say pleasant things about you and you're like, yes, of course. I love that. Good day. <laughs> <laughs> removing, removing the stupid bribe and fucking personality thing from from Skyrim was the saddest moment when I started playing. I was like, I want to bribe all the NPCs again, and then I couldn't do it. I'm like, you son of a bitch! How dare! I want them all to smile when they look at me rather than look at me deadpan. Thank you, kind sir. Thank you, kind sir. Last time on the Stone After dealing with the Earthen Lord Tartarus himself and managing to convince him to allow you to pass the future, final preparations were made after collecting the entirety of the Wolfwatch Colossus as well as the entirety of the Arms. You had actually managed to speak to Tartarus' heart, wherever it may lie, amongst his massive size. Into allowing you to pass through the rift using the massive Warforge Colossus. He did utter a warning ahead of time that if you were not successful, the Young Hand itself very well may try and force his way through the rift. And in the end, may end up causing another calamitous event of the four elements and the playing realms tearing even further. After the, all these forewarnings, and especially the very diligent debate, and obviously the very heavy, watchful, emerald eye of Tartarus, studying you, you over and listening to your words, seeing that the one who's meant to be sitting on the throne was made from the very materials that makes up this composition also one that would be able to last for an eternity. Brought him to be at least compelled enough to not only allow you to go through with your warranted idea, but also to send you assistance as well. A Dao Earth Genie to join the Earthen Myrmidons as well as Gargoyles. At this point, everyone's poised and ready. Everyone's made their preparations, their potions at the ready. Varric and Ricky's crew ready to fly the ship further through. His fellow Dijin ready to assist Alashim. Eerily calm, but understandably, as everyone else is tense, the rest of the Cursed Ones are feeling better. Looking better, a much more able regiment, along with some of the prison trapper mage regiment that is uh, accompanied with Commander Tidy to assist the Queen and Mr. Jiggles. Mr. Jiggles! I changed my mind. I think Mr. Jiggles should go on the throne. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Drop the jellyfish off the throne. <laughs> <laughs> the jellyfish will rise. The soft bodies will be the most ruling type. Oh, God. Yeah, it sounds I like a bad idea. A I think we <laughs> <laughs> I'll put the kelpie on the throne. I'll be fine. <laughs> My first order: necromantic rays, Grigori. <laughs> no. Oh no. <laughs> Not like this. Mm. <laughs> Wait, why am I worried? <laughs> yeah, we didn't kill him. Just 
Well, I mean, yeah, pretty much. I mean, we, we did kind of fail to really assist him, but I mean, to be fair, he did kind of <laughs> walk in there in front of like several guns. We made him solo in the final boss and then <laughs> while we were like in the corner. Well, and you know, he also, did it. He you fighting did dominated it. Iron Stride in the hallway. <laughs> was the, you guys were fighting the final boss while he was fighting the... Oh. He fucking did it, basically. It's like when you yeah. summon someone for a boss in Dark Souls and they die right before. Hey, Josh, um, I mean, I love Alashim's enthusiasm, but I don't think I would have let him out of the bottle until I needed him. <laughs> Letting him out's probably a poor idea, considering I was told very specifically they recognize Alashim and will want him back at like any cost. <laughs> Bring him in here is probably retarded, but you know I don't trust anybody on the outside to hold on to it. <laughs> it's like it is ultimate power, pretty much. Love you, Alashim, but you know, have a seat, buddy. We'll have you level some buildings. Oh, yes. <sighs> All right. It's time to be smart. Time to make sure we actually come back out. <laughs> Iron Strike, do you actually know how that sword thing works? To an extent. <sighs> All right. Uh, I guess I'm in charge, aren't I? A little. Uh, we're ready when you are. <laughs> I've never taken. I'm never taking another management position. The rest are probably my internal life. <laughs> <laughs> Let's face it. This one was thrust upon you. Sorry, Melly. <laughs> <laughs> this is why you don't get to be a dragon. I don't want to be a jerk. Yeah, still cool. Thank you very much, Miller. Anyways. <laughs> All right. So I feel like we should probably establish a marching order for our hopefully not suicidal charge into the hellscape. Yeah. First and foremost, I believe we should send in the Colossus first after it opens up the gate. It's probably the most threatening thing that we have. Following that up, depending on the size of the tear, if it's big enough, the ship should go in over the Earth Elementals, so kindly provided and so kindly helping our cause. Follow that up with the forces commanded by our good friend Virix Associate and the armies provided by the Coral Palace, and then we will bring up the rear. Any uh, objections? None. None. We shall not see no objections here. All right, then. Ready when you are, Iron Strat. I'm ready. Let's start heading into the portal. Oh shit, I'm so sorry, Berserk. Oh god. Oh, it a little bit. Oh god, it tricked me off. Oh god. Oh Jesus. Oh 
Oh, I've got Berserk all, all over my foot. Oh, <laughs> let me just scrape it off. Yeah. No, don't die. You're so sleep healthy. <laughs> 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 oh, step on our homies, you're so sexy, huh? <laughs> Alright, can we just close it behind him? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it, leave him in there. So, as you strike the blade between the rift, severing the planes <sighs> once more, you see the earth heaving, the fire ignites across the land, scorching everything. The water's washing over and just churning back to mud once more. All of them still fighting before you slowly start to see the runes traveling down the blade, forcing this planar rift apart as the gateway slowly becomes more prismatic. As you see it expanding further and further, you start to see Jotunheim, the area that you have seemed to have connected with. With beautiful, magnificent green marble stone, and what looks like a large quantity of hill giants wearing shackles and doing small tasks and work, before suddenly, as the veil is fully ripped open, a massive sun thundering thunder wave rolls over and crackles across the field, and you can see. Many of the hill giants go flying and immediately die on impact after the humongous traumatic force ripping the planes apart. Nice. As you immediately enter in, you would see that you're on the edge of Jotunheim's many towered halls. On the very cusp where the hill giants and stone giants live on the outer ring of the floating city. All right, I'm going in. Let's go! <laughs> Woo! Ah, uh, yeah. Holy <laughs> shit. Hey, Josh, this is a big map, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. It, it's, it's not just big, it's long, too. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Hey, guys, I wonder where the end point is. So I should like put myself inside the road bot. Shinji. <clears throat> Alrighty. So with this, especially everyone following through from the main rifts, you can see many of the hill giants confused, hurt, many of them dead from the area that you forcefully entered in. The rift still behind you. <laughs> Sorry. Hurry. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> 58. No, that's fine. Right on the back of the dragon. So, as you looked at this city, you'd see many splendors, staggered towers climbing up to one pinnacle, dead center of the city, with a beautiful, immaculate glow of gold and sunlight. Every single area on the outer rims climbing up to this magnificent tower. All the various elements in respect of each of the giants. Obviously the ones that you have entered into. You can see the roaming fields that the hill giants tend to. Many of them farms, farm animals, creatures, as well as the stone pillars and towers of all the stone giants. And just further beyond that, you can see the glacial peak towers that block and bar your way as the main row heads straight up the 
What is your plan? You can see some of the hill giants are starting to collect themselves at this moment. You see the stone giants are not about to let you pass as they ready weapons fashion for their various colors. This time we have brought the fight to them. Charge! Yeah. I'd start to advance! Yeah, I drank my potion. I'm flying forward to try and catch up with the Colossus. <laughs> I don't know, how fast does this fucking thing move? Uh, you should see it in the Warforged Colossus. Let's see, we'll forge classic. It doesn't actually really say anything about it in terms of its movement speed. It's just basically just a description. Alright, this it, yeah, it's been just a big description. Yeah. It tells me where I can find uh, more of it. No, we can't see that. It just says bio and info. Uh, hold on, hold on. I know the problem. Ah, uh, I swear I'm not that retarded. <laughs> hey. Oh, 60 feet. Nice. Oh god, what's his attack? Oh god, oh Jesus. <laughs> oh god, oh fuck, oh god, oh fuck. One with its slam, two with its turrets, and then you use his stomp. Oh my god. Oh yeah, plus 18. Two with the turrets. You know, it's a if the target is a creature, everything here, it is not prone. Jesus! <laughs> Your father did not fuck around. I'm gonna be honest, Iron Shard hits about as hard as this Colossus. <laughs> <laughs> Go on to continue. Yeah, Iron Shard just needs a death laser. <laughs> oh, you have a passive fear effect. I well, do. of course he does! He's a fucking huge machine! <laughs> if they start the turn within 30 feet, you mean stomping distance? This is 26 with saving throw, we fight! Yeah, because 30 feet is within stomping distance. Within 30 feet is the death range. Well then, I guess we are rolling in this. We are. Yeah, I need to be big. Yeah, I know. Make make me the huge. I'm also curious, how does this thing actually alter our movement speed? I don't think it really does. I mean, I'll go look. I don't think it says anything about our movement speed. It might That's it might multiply it by two. I mean, if we're gaining two sides classes, I feel like we should be faster. Yeah, because bigger steps. But it also would kind of make sense that we wouldn't be, considering we wouldn't be very used to being this big. Yeah. So really could go either way. Against the rules of relativity of mass. Hmm. Okay, so I'm presuming I'm rolling the uh, Warforged Colossus's deck for my... Oh no, it's going to be an initiative button. Here we go. I'll write down my base HP because I'm about to multiply it. <laughs> I'm gonna get real big. As the gin. All three. They are going to sweep through with the wind elementals and handle that stuff. Never disappoint, do you tell, Rath? <laughs> God damn, he's right me. Guys, ready for six hours of combat? Uh huh. Uh, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Obviously. Six years. That's why I'm here. That's why I'm here. You didn't want to sleep tonight, right, Nick? <laughs> well. I mean, I'm fine. It's not like I have anything to do tomorrow. Quarantine. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's on, boys. Okay, so. I have. Let's just modify my HP now that I've recorded it. This guy is gonna immediately charge over here and start handling the other hell giants. Three hundred and eight. 
308. <laughs> then multiply this one by two. Oh, 508. I have 816 total HP. Dude, nice. My Colossus just has half that. <laughs> I only have 374. But it does have certain It does yeah, nice. damage immunities. Oh god, I didn't even see that it has damage immunities. Oh my god! Bludgeoning, piercing, and slashing, all from non-magical <laughs> attack. You have true sight of 150 feet. Can't hide, bitch. Oh, and you get legendary resistances. Sick. My god. Nice. Oh, yeah, don't forget the incinerating beam. Yeah, magic <laughs> resistance, <laughs> double damage to objects. Yeah, the double damage to objects is probably going to be really useful here. They're probably going to put a lot of gates in our way. <laughs> <laughs> You're on gate duty. What do you mean, man? I'm just going to break through it. Thanks, Siege Monster. Up. How far can we move? Like one turn? Uh, just behind me. Uh, let's see. Probably. Yeah, Peter's gonna be the fuck stuff. Uh, behind or beside the window that goes here. Okay. Well, then I will just move up to here because I'm ranged. I have not, so I'll get as close as I fucking can. How far away am I? Oh, that isn't even that bad. Yeah, that, that that's good. <laughs> yeah, you can shoot that far. Welcome to the courtyard. Literal big bird. Bring yeah, like I said, I li with the crossbow, I'm literally firing a ballista now. Kunk. Oh, did you find anything we have? Movement speed? No. That would be entirely up to Josh, and I mean, I think it's fair enough that it doesn't. Mm -hmm. yeah, the, the potion is very like good. Well, actually, yeah, never mind. I'm gonna get closer because I'm gonna end up having to use the great bow if I stay much further back, so I'll stay right here. Please tell me that was Reverick. Yes. I mean, I gotta fuck with you guys a little bit. <laughs> Turn him, you panic attack. Don't worry, I'll punch him real hard. <laughs> Baneless comes in and just fucking. The Colossus just clocks him out of the station. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here! What the fuck are you doing? I'm sorry, sir. It's time for you to leave. And so it is. <laughs> Damn, Virik got. I mean, Virik, Virik doesn't act. Virik actually has my decks. <laughs> He's what? slightly better than me. <laughs> Eldritch turret has 300 feet of range. I mean, hey. That's, that's still less range than I have. True, it's still a fucking lot of range. You're a machine designed to win wars. <laughs> yeah, by itself. Did Velas not drink his potion? Uh, not yet. I'd rather have 160 moves. Uh, that is fair. You're gonna use it like you're gonna like drop feet first onto him and drink it. <laughs> also, I've got a lot of buffs to cast on this, so I can do it while flying. All right. So kicking this off is actually gonna be very shit, buddies. <laughs> Let's 
skirt over everyone close to some of the buildings, which they are immediately going to start firing down their cannons. Imagine if we got the CB in on this with his cannon. I don't think it, his ship couldn't fit in here. No, he comes in with it in the key and then summons it on this side of the portal. <laughs> Just oh, above no. Jotunheim. <laughs> you mail. Well, a natural one and a natural 20. He <laughs> truly got the full range. That's the point where it's just like the gunpowder's wet. <laughs> the water elementals got on board for a second. <laughs> There's explosions of acid, fire, and lightning everywhere. <laughs> I pull out the crossbow. <laughs> the ballista. I draw my plus three ballista. <laughs> uh, check, check, check. Mm, not in range for that. Oh, okay. Uh, one, two, against this dude. That was definitely fucking strike. Okay. Let's go! Alright, I'm done. Berserkers. Oh yeah, Berserkers. Okay, boys. Go, get him! Move up your, your 60 feet. <laughs> okay, they, they've charged and screamed. <laughs> We're gonna kill the entire population of giants by the time we get to the throne. <laughs> Uh, Misty, would you have your original? 
forward. Yes. This is one of those situations where I feel like I'm not sure I deserve to be in control of Raxiel. <laughs> so I would tell him to stay back and be safe, but I feel Raxiel would be a little rebellious towards that kind of order. <laughs> and be like, I want to help and fly up. But, like, even at a dash, he's not going to reach any of But the, the best he can do is get up to one of them. Which is a terrible idea. Why not just have him, like, fly up and then, like, get in position to start throwing spores at people or something? Yeah, he's... He's going to, like, fly up to here, but up in the air. So they can't just whack him. Let's go, uh, seven. <laughs> Dragon, dragon, rock the dragon. <laughs> Rexy yells. Rexy yells dead. Oh. One boulder struck him square in the face. Which still requires him to dash, so he can't do anything else. I also don't know what spells he can cast. <laughs> Oh shit, I didn't even see all these boys in the fright. Oh, he does know fireball, flame, bolt, shatter, and such. Fuck yeah. He also knows conjure. Like, obviously, with diamonds and such. Alright, well, I'll, I'll start throwing some of those onto his sheet for now. <laughs> Position for more. You can see 
quite a few of these stone giants are making their way out of the fucking Zen Gardens. It's no time to be peaceful. Peace was never an option. Stone wall. In between them, just to try and bottle them, neck them longer. Mr. Jiggles. Yeah, it's Jiggles point. What do we got? Fantastic joy. I'm going to pick up Rexiel. Peter is going to dash. He has 80 foot flying speed, so get to this boy. And I'm going to take some action to drink the potion. First, I will bonus action Shield of Faith, and then I will chuck the potion. Obviously, using my movement to get off Peter first. Not squishy. He's squishing like a poke. So, any spell that affects only me also affects my mount, so he gets bonus haste.
float my full 60 feet on the carpet. I don't think I can dash with it. You can. Ah, cool. All right. Another 60 feet. And that will be all. Oh, that's what those are. What kind of giant is that? Female one. It's a priest. Strong okay. point. Good point. It was in the Zen Garden, so it does make sense that it might be a priest. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my aura is bigger because I am bigger. Really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. The more you know, out from, me. from him. Yeah, right? that checks out. This one. Enchanted. Which way to you? Now we move up to another ring. So you can see some of the priests moving out. The wall being held up. This courtyard looks like it'd be easy to lock down. Can only reach one thing from here. But you know what? It'll do. I'm just gonna blast fire at this bitch. Go and approach. You just see the calmest face as you breathe the fire. Should I bother to roll with that? <laughs> She's just covered. <laughs> She's just uh, centered. She doesn't have to I'll roll it regardless. <laughs> cool. I'm making a pass over. Uh, <laughs> Alright, well it's half on a success. Uh, no, I'm, I'm Telrath right, right now. <laughs> no, you still have your dash. Yeah, as Telrath, no, you are literally I, just Telrath, but level 17 and with more health. Yeah, I, I know that. I was just asking if I got my dash bonus action ability when I turned into a dragon. Like, if I physically became the gold dragon. Oh, no, yeah, you would, because it's still just polymorph. <laughs> Okay, cool. Just wanted to clear that. Uh, the simulacrum is going to toss out 
a freezing sphere to uh, let's go snap to corner. It's, Yeah, like over this, these guys. Pot. Uh, yes. Uh, while I. Aside from that, the simulator will remain on me. So that is its turn. doesn't work because I'm just a smidge tired. So I go to there and then I just go and then I don't. I forgot to let go. I was still looking at it. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, that looks right, right? And fuck, KJ. Uh, the Iron Colossus. <laughs> I'm not teasing Tilrith. What? The Colossus will move up. It's <laughs> sick. 60 feet. <laughs> <laughs> she looked calm before. What happened now? Still stealthy. <laughs> but <laughs> does, she, <laughs> but does she succeed? <laughs> oh, yes. She is terrified. Well, that's, that's the start its turn, though. Oh, that's true, yeah, that's fair. Okay, well, she, I mean, she doesn't get to be scared just yet. That's okay. You can see all yeah, the okay. giants don't want to fucking be anywhere near you. I assume that is. Fuck yeah. <laughs> and now, the Eldritch turret. Oh, she's not. She's not within five feet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck. Yeah, fuck her up. <laughs> <laughs> she's not prone, I think. <laughs> so now I fire at uh, this guy. <laughs> he's, 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 he's not prone. This is illegal. And um, now I stomp. Oh my lord! No, Commander Tidelight. <laughs> oh, no, I, I, I can put it like I can put it like over here, so it hits her, and that's it. Oh, okay. It has a twenty foot range. Uh, how much does it roll? A oh my 6 god, it does sixty ten damage. Boy. <laughs> 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 
you see remarkably bits and pieces of her flying fucking everywhere. Oh, cool. Fucking <laughs> trying to hold her shit together. <laughs> At this point, just like trying to crawl away, hardly alive. At this point, <laughs> oh no! Completely restrained. That is that is the Colossus's turn. Fearing uh, ship. Oh, there I am. I was having trouble finding myself. Okay. Yeah. Okay, I will fly 90 feet forward using the bonus action dash. And then uh, let's look around the room. Thales probably got that handled. I'll, sh I'll shoot that uh, stone face individual in the back. Normal shooting. No, oh, wait, wait, what was the distance again? I gotta double check. 150. I'll use the bow. Okay. I'll use the bow. Bow is this one, yeah. Okay. One, two. As usual. <laughs> well, the first one will first show. That's, that's the Telrath trademark of hit with one, miss with the other. Hit or miss? I do a bit of both, huh? enough to take down the priest, especially after the barracks falling. <laughs> Clean up crew. Alright, okay, berserkers. Ah! <laughs> they moved 60.1 feet, but we'll accept it. Hey, wait for me! I don't know what the... Oh, I didn't even <laughs> see him. <laughs> like, he doesn't get to play anymore. <laughs> I don't want to play with you anymore. <laughs> oh yeah, Mr. Krabs. Okay, I'm done. Crax is just gonna drop down and assist Valus. One bite. Oh, that should have been an advantage. Useful, really, but not useful enough. And too close. Okay. 
Raxel's poison hide feature states any creature of the dragon's choice that comes into contact with it takes 1d6 poison damage. Would that count when he attacks someone? Okay. In that case. And I'm going to throw poison the damage onto his attacks. So I don't have to roll it manually. Just getting ready to raise up the stone club. Alright, there we go. Start beating on the wall and then moving out to here to greet the rest of the gargoyles and stone boys. This guy's gonna fucking stand up and fucking run for his fucking life. What <laughs> bitch? Oh god, oh fuck, oh god, oh fuck. I feel like the ship is the smallest problem they have in the room right now. <laughs> I mean, it just... It did like 150 damage on its turn. Well, yeah, it's fucking no, shit up. It killed like three giants in one volley. Yeah, we, we probably should have went and stole another warship, honestly. Oh, okay now. Yeah. I bought potions, it's basically the same deal. I'm our artillery cannon. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you are. Over. Weaves up the one arm and just brings them all back down, <laughs> crush, crushing the face entirely. If it helps, you see uh, the, the Colossus is ready to start heading straight up the middle. Yeah. No, I, I would I would like to kneel up here so I can at least gauge out the air. Oh, that's not bad. 
stuff. You get up to there, especially with the huge boom of the dimension door. All the frost giants are going to look rather confused at you. Smile and wave. See a few of them point to you. You do it all more, Get out! You know what? I couldn't speak the language. I shouldn't have come to this plane. Josh is sweating like I made this map, now they're gonna break it. It's perfect. It's perfect. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that was Mr. Jiggle's turn, so... Well, it's... It's still he likes it away. Yeah, I'm gonna hit him twice with my head. Oh, God. Hey. Holy Avenger plus Big Dick Potion! Aww, <laughs> yee! You better have labeled the damage just Big Dick Damage. Oh, uh, no. If heretic. <laughs> yeah, get 2d10 if they're like your fingers. Uh, here's this critical damage. Ignore the if heretic if they're not a heretic. <laughs> Even just with the crit damage alone, you just quickly cut off one arm and then just drive it through his side and shatter them to stone on the floor. Nice. Nice. Uh, I turn to Brad and ask if he wants a lift. I'll be alright. Peter's like way faster than your carpet. And you can command him if you want. No! <laughs> no! Right, no, no, listen to the bird! I guess they're on 30 feet. Uh, Peter dashes. Yeah. Should, should he go die to these fucking giants on his own? I think he should. <laughs> nah, he'll go this way. I'll turn invisible for now. And the carpet by itself mysteriously moves 60 feet up. Hey, I still see you. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. But you can still hide behind the massive pillar. She <laughs> walks through pillar. Oh, it is regular invisibility, not greater. Some noise coming from the other side of the garden. Alright, first of all, I get my breath back. <laughs> yeah, something like that. Just a moment before you're suffocating. But for now, I'm just gonna charge ahead, and that's as far as I can get. <laughs> Commander. Damn. Let's 
simulacrum is just gonna throw a fireball down at these. Spells. Fireball. Definitely did not fucking enjoy that. Good, they're not meant to. Very sourced. That. Uh, is oh god. Blush. So this game. Yo, let's move up thirty feet. About a fireball. Throw, throw a rock. Throw a rock. Giants can throw no, no, rocks. No. Can we throw rocks? I can throw <laughs> Mr. Jiggles. No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's, like a, it's like a soft little squishy ball you're throwing, basically. And then he turns into <laughs> an electric taser. <laughs> right. But yeah, no, I guess I'm gonna throw my javelin of lightning this way. Think about hitting the boy back here. Just fucking short. I mean, really, I just want to use the free bolt of lightning. Bolt of lightning! Lightning! I should have been disadvantaged. I should have been disadvantaged. I'm How many d6? Some. 46, I think. Sorry. Let me check. I've got a little bright dead family. Yeah, 46. Oh, I wasted my crit to show you how much damage it does. 46. You should take my crit then, Mitch. You always take that one and a net 20. Oh, yeah. Nice. Balances out. Bitches. Equivalent exchange. Throw that. Kim get zap. And then and then I call it back. And, and, and that's, that's not very nice. I don't want to do this any further. I want to wait a little bit. Especially looking into this hall now. It's a bright, brilliant flash showing the icy, frigid halls that you are entering into here. Mm hmm. You can feel entering into these halls would probably plummet into sub-zero temperatures. Staying in these halls would be extremely ill-advised. It's a good thing we don't have some sea creatures in here that'll probably be sensitive to the sudden change in temperature. Yeah, not at all! I mean, the sea creatures... the ocean is cold. Yeah, they're from like a fucking reef, man. It's not that cold. Welcome reef. to the coral reef, man. Colossus. Yeah, Miss Keel, come back. Generally in warm water. <laughs> Miss Keel, come to the group. Yeah, it's, it's, it's getting a mite chilly up here. We're gonna have to be quick in this one. Yeah, Colossus. Good word. Uh, frostbite. Just 
No, no, I'm here, sorry. Uh, I was getting spoken to by someone. And I move up my lovely 120... to... <laughs> Squeeze. Hello. Please stop. I cannot do anything else. So I stand here. And look at him menacingly. You just look at him between those like, your legs and he's just like fucking <laughs> falling behind and trying to like scramble away at this point. <laughs> <laughs> yep, that's me moving up. I'm done. Some of the respected cross giant warriors. That's what it's gonna be. Boy, you didn't know this is Yes, group together back then. Cowering underneath you. Stop trying to clear the way ahead of you! Alright, I will try to keep up. Is it my turn already? Five years later. I will move, move to here. And then, uh, well, you know what? Sure. I'll pistol whip this guy. Got to rapidly switch weapons. It's uh, it improves your accuracy. Bang, bang. Oh, I don't, I don't get the third shot because I just bonus action dash. Gosh darn it! Shit. The first one hits. There we go. That's how you normally fake it to begin with, man. Solid strike from the force pistol on the other one. It's a little bit wide past him. Now you can see the. Basically firing. 
just starts swarming around him now. All right, now I, I won't forget my Berserker. <laughs> Come on, boys. <laughs> They're just spending the entire time running. Do they have like a certain limit that they can stay active or they're just here till they die? Here till they die. Nice. These guys are gonna make it to the throne. Probs not this guy. But the rest of them. Giants and making sure that they don't fuck with the portal or come up behind you. Rex, yeah, will charge up. That's it, he dashed. Uh, I will dash. Jesus, that's like one quarter of the way. Uh, I assume this is high enough for Peter to go over. Don't. Could he stop, like, here? Yeah, well that's his movement. Can you make two attacks? Multi-attack. Uh, 
No, he's, he's not the strongest, but he's, he's gonna help out. Man, he got this. Bro. That's all. Oh, really oh cool. God. Uh, Vader! <laughs> <laughs> Why is it like hey. a Pokemon and it just says it's her name constantly? <laughs> <laughs> hey, Peter, watch this. <laughs> I'm Peter, pretty sure Peter, Peter. I'm the only one who can actually hear him talk. It's like a telekinesis thing. <laughs> That's even worse. <laughs> oh no. Uh, and then... Oh, I can't, I can't, like, split up our turns. It's sort of cheating. That's fine. I was gonna Sanctuary, but I already did my stuff. You can't really split your turns like that. Yeah, that's it. Uh, another 60 feet, and then dash the 60 feet after. Yeah. Make it there. Excellent. Really? Melee's turn to move forward a bit. How tall is this little corridor here? Uh, this little corridor is vaulted at 80 feet. Cool, so I can still be up nice and high and fire breath over Misky. Yeah, it's true. And it would be very neat because you could feel the deathly chill that fills this hole. Yeah, well, it's only gonna hit one dude anyway. <laughs> but fire breath. starting to pop through on, uh, on his face it, where the flesh is just completely melted off. Uh, yes. Commander. Making sure to be in go with his queen. Also out from under the iron glosses of They're moving up quickly. Fuck it. Cold room, frosty boys. Just fireball these three. Smack the man in front of me. Get fucked on. Many 
fire damn it. Don't think about us. <laughs> so you just, just see this guy down on his knees, like, sucking wind and hurt, and you just take a mercy kill on him and just <laughs> cut his head off. Nice. And now I will step around the corner into scary cauldron. I think I'm smoking crack. Uh, but you can tell a lesser being would probably be slowly frostbitten to death. Well, probably not slowly at this rate. Probably frozen solid. Fairly quick. So bright. Oh boy. <laughs> I should actually be fine. I got that cotton feet. I am Colossus. I have to try and move up. And I have to try to get through it. Step on so many dragons. Oh, I can step over them. Oh, I just said a great ball. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so well, I got get them. I guess I guess I'm using my. Uh, if I'm disintegrating, I'm guessing I'm using the incinerating beam. It's a 150 foot line. Just... Yes. Let's see how much it does. It's 11d10. Oh. Must make a 26 dexterity saving throw. It's rolled out 11d10 on that boy who got caught in the fucking blast radius. He took 50 damage. Hold it on by fucking dreams at this point. He's just sitting, uh, sitting there recoiling from the fireball and then suddenly just <laughs> through the wall. Just Jesus Christ! Fireball, help me! Can't save you now. Beep. Alright, that's. Taking a better aim, he will swing straight for your neck. He's going to hit you with a 24. Oh, right. so, it's coming straight at your head. <laughs> Bounces off the barrier. This guy is going to charge up to Guy takes a look at you, the Iron Colossus, and then decides to throw a piece of broken wall at the griffin at the front. <laughs> it's like, oh, no. No. How oh, dare! No. Not the griffin. Uh, and he'll hit Peter for the 24 uh, no, Peter. for 41 Peter. bludgeoning damage. Uh, uh. <laughs> Not much. Nobody <laughs> uh, so. know. It's okay. He's he's a spiritual being. He's fine if he dies, but. Okay. But he still feels the pain, right? Peter. 
<laughs> Peter feels bad. Why yeah, have you here? forsaken Peter? What the fuck is <laughs> Alrighty, so in the distance you can hear the arcane cannons blasting as well as Boreas flying through and summoning more wind elementals. You can hear the return of fire. Ballista. Fired up for Sorry, I was talking to something. Yeah, I need to get to there, the pillage. I moved 50 feet and remember to check my pistol's range. And I was never given a range for the pistols. I've just been considering it 100 feet without asking, but it is 3090. Okay, well, I've overestimated it a couple times, but I was pretty close. So, well, I can't even shoot at him. Yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna move my additional 50 feet. F it. <laughs> Let's get closer. Yeah. Now, how am I feeling? <laughs> I bet this boy's feather. Okay, I'll get out the lightning bow. <laughs> <laughs> Zoot, oh my zoot. Pistol. Ooh, double 24. Yeah. That boy. Alright. Roll that damage. Fire lightning bolts across the field. Dang. That's two massive strikes in the chest. You see these enormous scorch marks in his chest as he falls down, blood spilling across the floor. <laughs> oh god, he froze solid instantly. <laughs> oh wait, I, I can't move that guy inside of somebody, can I? That would be difficult terrain. One sec, okay. You get a different movement pattern. <laughs> Okay, there we go, okay. The darkers are done. I like how the big boy with the thunderbolt hammer is just killing hill giants at the back. Yes. It's awesome. It's like wiffle ball for him. Uh-huh. <laughs> and he's using a metal bat. <laughs> oh no. Alright. Max is gonna fly into the room. Up nice high in the air. Let's get that up to like an eight. And then Fireball three, uh, four of them. I'm good at counting. Interesting. It's an easy DC. I can't make that save. <laughs> it's impossible unless I have a negative one in decks and I roll a, ne a one. According to his sheet, the spell save DC is supposed to be 18. Huh. If I do this, what happens? I'm just testing it. Uh, no, it still says zero. Okay, that's interesting. What if I place it off of... I'm just gonna set this to GM while I mess with it to try to make it work. Oh, that went way too high.
retarded. Freeze, sorry. Oh, freeze? I moved my mic way too far away. Yeah. Maybe I shouldn't have asked. Seems like I'm flying over the cold area. We don't need a burp sickle. This palace opened up. Can you re enter elsewhere? Uh, you can definitely buy over here oh. Yeah. Not what? Oh, that's a lot of damage to take per chest. Yeah. Holy shit. It's kinda algae. I mean, actually, I don't really know why I care. I have, I have like 800 of <laughs> Yeah, for us mortals, that's a lot. I'm just gonna flank. It's gonna take two hits on the first one on the right. Well, by two hits, I mean his multi attack action. One peak, two claws. It's supposed to be an advantage. Nice. This is 20 hit. Uh, and then Vel's dash. And. Yeah. Especially since you're all very, very close to them. And those who are used to the magic area, with the whole blowing and coughing, frigid breeze. You would assume that somebody might be channeling some kind of divine or arcane powers to maintain this hall's frigid air. Mother doing that shit up there. <laughs> I wonder if it's this guy with the clock connects to him. <laughs> Possibly. <laughs> maybe, maybe. We can't see that guy. Not yet. I mean, I can sense him. Uh, yeah, but you can sense like a million things. You know. Yeah, I know. Oh, Alright, I have decided to fly over the top. How tall is this place? Uh, for the height of this place, especially with the vaulted 80 foot ceilings, yeah. it actually peaks out at a beautiful 140 foot. Ooh, alright, I'll do it. Uh, first, I'll give an inspiration to Iron Stride. Oh. You only need to hear me, so. Get that. Inspired. And then I ascend 120 feet. Alrighty. So which, at this point, getting close to the top, you start to see the volcanic peaks and towers, beautifully crafted steels, all shimmering in the deep, dark obsidian below. Just beyond that, you would see towers made of marble and cloud. A little bit further as well, you'd see lightning sparkling, filling halls with energy pulsing through prismatic crystals. 
and then seeing the golden tower at the very top that looks like it's been lit with the sun. Yeah, they got biomes. <laughs> oh wait, are there, are there blisters on top of this place? Like anti-air? Well, or is, is stuff shooting at Virik's ship? Hundred percent. Mm. <laughs> maybe, yeah, I go back down. maybe I go back down. <laughs> oh, well. I've moved. Too late. Definitely see Boreas as well flying through the air with fireballs going up. So. I, uh, first of all, need to check if I get my breath back, which I don't. I'm gonna zoom in a bit. Instead, uh, we'll just fly over these guys, smack the ground, and strike. Uh, Oh, gold dragon. Since I'm not doing a breath attack, uh, they can make me some wisdom save. I will buy Claw Claw. Life. As soon as he starts bleeding out, the same once again, it freezes over him. And then, uh, since I remembered that I have it, and uh, I'm actually close enough, uh, bonus action, uh, puff a hot air at the one above me. Uh, as soon as I figure out where the button is again. You're just gonna smoke his cock off on him like that, dude. Not cool. <coughs> PJ's player gets provoked coronavirus. Oh, no. oh shit. A slow and insidious killer. I have to assume it's this one. Yeah, sure thing. Uh, uh, Josh, I don't, don't want to say. Does Peter have to make a con save? He had some fun. Hey, he made it to the second room. He he attacked like four different giants. It's true. He fucked up the other one real bad. Sure. Peter Peter dematerialized a hero. Really did. Uh a set of custom fucking Griffin balding falls to the ground. No! As Peter turns into dust. The dust. Ba -da -dum. Ba -ba. Ba -da -ba.
けない。Simulate current. Uh, hmm. Let me just quickly check how the thing works. Uh, okay, good. There's no description there. Super useful. Room uses this boss scepter to cast Thunder Wave. Where is. Do I even have Thunder Wave on this sheet? I might not. It's okay, I can just add it to the sheet. Thunder Wave. At fourth. Well, the DC is 16. Yes. Uh, yes. on this boy. Do I have to move over to the left one more? Uh, no, you would have to manage just the way you are. Could you see what you oh, bitch. I presume the simulator also has to make a con save. Uh, yes, it does. Eat, uh, dick. I will note the simulator is a, is resistant to cold damage. Good. Res con. Uh, Putting that damage on there. <laughs> Kill him, Dash. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Make sure he's never getting back up. Um, I actually, I have a question. I should have asked before. Is there a big, like, step up here? Yeah, because I would more straight of like a courtesy step. Like. Okay, so it's, it's nothing. Is what you're saying? Pretty much. The lazy men take the short stairs. The real men step up. Sorry, I was trying to move, and then had to hit escape because the thing moved too far. Uh, Miski will then set up the. Yes. We need to figure out what's making it cold, so that we can get everybody else through safe. Resistance, does that get reduced? Yes. So, hey! I have infernal resistance. Oh, infernal constitution, so fire, cold, and poison resistance. Yeah, that, that would be it. Yeah. Take your hand. Thank you. <laughs> 
to your half and go. Beyond Lapis Musa? Dashes, I guess. Just the Smashing its way through. It's just like, ah! as the pillars are getting crushed and part of the tower starts collapsing up. <laughs> That's uh, that is that is my action. Oh, and I have the roll. That's right. Slash R. Uh, Two six. I do not get my attack. Does the stu have a constitution saving throw? Does the, the Colossus have the constitution? Uh, it does, but I don't or think it can fail it. It has a plus 10. Uh, oh, it's rolling. insulated. It might, it might be able to fail. How did the Colossus pass the it's cold weird. temperature? It's air-conditioned. <laughs> nice. I mean, it has HVAC. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, don't touch the thermostat. Swinging at disadvantage, because at least going to go out swinging. One at the Colossus and then one at the dragon. <laughs> Both turned to 15 and nothing. Which weird. Did you hear massive air battle cannons firing off of him then? Oh. Let's walk forward some more, as is the custom of my people. These berserkers did not come here to fight, they came to participate in the fitness proof. <laughs> the fitness gram answer test. <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> I guess I will sh shoot this guy. Is this guy prone or is he just having a really bad day? A really bad day. <laughs> okay. Well, the I'll, I'll end this really bad day. Yeah, I mean, I, I really don't doubt it. Bang. Ooh. Ooh, cursed. <laughs> His day got a little bit better. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, I'll finish moving my additional however many feet, and I'll stand at the threshold of the cold room, feeling the chill. And the berserkers. <laughs> Come on, you're not telling your fitness gram pacer test. <laughs> in the suit with me. It's true. Algorith, Adel, Templar, Jonas Lucius is keeping an eye on the people in the back line. Okay. Also got Berger with me as well in there. Yeah. Yeah. Um, move around the flag. He's a bloodthirsty dragon, what can I say? Oh, I left him on GM with all of that messing around with his fireball. Do any of those miss? The 16? Understandable. Given the way you described it, I assumed that this uh, frosty room counts as a magical effect. It does. 
Okay, then he has advantage on his con save. <laughs> Oh. Grab onto your leg, Alice. Wait, she just grabbed onto my leg. And. Oh. oh. I was gonna do that. I grab the head. No, I was gonna use my teleportation helm and teleport into the fire room. Because hmm? I love fire. Well, now you have a perfect sight of it. Those pillars are really good. I love fire. Right. Hey, Peter. <laughs> Mr. Jiggles, if you will approach that green. <laughs> Shall we move forward again? We need to find a source of what's making this room cold so everybody else can get through. I will search for it. Please. He's going to leap forward. Now we got thinking to do. Does it hurt? Is it worth using a fucking one of my three teleportation charges to skip this entire room? To avoid maybe like 30 damage? I mean, it. Considering you'd have to walk through it, it'd probably be closer to like 60 damage plus. Um, fuck, I have to... Do you have to be like touching your friends to teleport them? Uh, yes. I believe so, yeah. It's like a 10 foot range. Uh, yeah, I'll move, like, 30 feet. Fuck, that's not very far at all, is it? Can you teleport the Colossus? I, mm, no. well, we couldn't even teleport one piece of the Colossus, so, no. Yeah, that's a fair point, yeah. Um, everyone just grab onto me, or don't, don't take us past this room. I'll hold my action to teleport. Spend my turn descending 120 feet. <laughs> Spend well, up there. The door, door. Okay. Because you're hugging the building at least. Sure, at the threshold. Yep. Uh, Telerth can have its reparation. Par. Inspired. Inspiracion. I end my turn. <laughs> That's all it takes. My turn. Get a d6. I get my breath back. It's time to move up. I dash. That is my turn. Oh, jeez. Especially being that far up. Jiggles is having a little bit of a hard time, but especially with keen fragment senses, you can hear someone praying and chanting to your right. Alright. Especially following after that. Commander Tylen will trust Malice. I am gone. Seeing melee comes turn, it will. 
let's see, what has it got? into here. Uh... Oh yeah, it's red. Yeah, dragon. That's nice work, boys. Smash Bank, gotta explain shit. For this turn, uh, there doesn't really have any, like, enemies in sight. Uh, the simulacrum is just gonna hunker down and, uh, by technicality, take the dodge action. Josh, did Tideland roll with advantage and plus six? With Yay! Yeah. <laughs> and then it makes its con save as well. so much further because of our token size and then oh wait yeah. it's because we massive and that's my turn Somebody. I've Otherwise, dashed. I can't all these do boys it. behind I'm us are gonna freeze in this fucking room. <laughs> it's like I had a console. I'm gonna oh, yell okay. <laughs> Damn it. You guys knew this shit wasn't gonna be easy. You are fine. He prays. Oh, don't we pray. Oops. Fuck. Too worthy. Put fear except. Oh, my God. I'm powered up. Get in there. Uh, for the heck of it, I'm gonna turn into a golden dragon and then go touch Valus. All right, and then can't touch. save. And then can't save. <laughs> At advantage plus six. That's the main reason why I did it exactly like this. <laughs> okay, one sec. I gotta go edit my con score now. It's now twenty-five. Con around Valus just for the fucking safety of getting through the room. <laughs> yep. Yep. Okay, well with the plus six, that's a twenty-three. Six eight. And I mean that was my entire turn. I did you know. It's an action that transforms. So. Adel and Just do it. Oh yeah, sorry. Thank, thank you for reminding me yet again of my fitness gram pacer test. Did I notice this guy as I walked past? <clears throat> uh, for him, yes, you definitely would have noticed it. Yeah, okay. Yeah, true sight one to one fifty. Yeah, you know what? That's fair. True sight one hundred twenty feet. I know he's there. Okay. To his I point in that direction. I hear someone over there. Just 
You must be eliminated quickly so that our forces may proceed. Thanks, yeah. I've got this, man. We're doing great. Voice breaks halfway through statement. We're doing great. We're doing great. Still growing into an ancient one. It's not ancient just yet. Just yet. <laughs> <laughs> yes, well, Rax, uh, uh, it seems that there's someone in the room over to the right, so maybe you should do something about that. <laughs> Fly over, can you, can you like spy him through the doors? Yes, you can. You see your boy in there? Okay, he cast Fireball. You can sneak a peek perfectly. Shoots Fireball right in there. Fireball! Oof. All right. The okay. Axel makes a con save. to be back. Excellent work, Jiggle. Oops. Well. <laughs> You're ready. Everyone's on it. Well, not everyone, but I think I can't hold a spell for more than one round. Well, bye, Brad. I teleport. It's like 100% if you can see it, right? Yes. Yeah. There's, there's no roll. You can see it. So, uh, there. Alrighty, let me unveil some goodies. Hey, look, I'm What? What do you mean? Da 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 da. I I was here. Look, I'm its face. Unless that's a wall, then I don't want to be in the wall. Yeah, I was behind Valus, unless that's also a wall, then I'll be somewhere <laughs> else. Ooh, ooh, what are those? Ooh. Hey, look, it's the ship. Oh, what? yes. It's hell. Oh, glorious. Oh, God. Oh, this doesn't go. Oh, actually, it goes right. My guess, yeah, Emilius Boreas is in here, so, you know. He's fucking shit. So would that have been my held action? Like, can I go? Uh, yes, that would be your held action. I was waiting for everyone. Uh... I... Do we get extra range as a big boy? Yeah, the commander would have come with us if he was touching veils. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do we get extra know. reach for a big dick potion? You get an additional uh, five feet. Five feet. Something. That's enough. 
Actually, I'm technically touching him anyway, because we should yeah, be squares. You, you are, yeah. You couldn't really be much closer. No, no, no. Insert yourself into his no no square. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Not the no no square. Don't touch him there. That is his no no square. <laughs> Into his back and turns around. Goodbye, you know what? Lamo. Level two. I did it. I used a spell slot. I didn't mean to click the javelin or lightning. <laughs> I meant the divine smite. Guards in the towers are maintaining cannons and firing them up at the ship, in which the ship is now on fire. Oh! You can see Varric is going around and trying to, well, put out the fires as best he can with Ricky against the rest of the crew is firing down. They were distracting him for a time. Boreas is doing much better at weaving and dodging. And well, effectively, you've been fighting a few things. You do see it looks to be various piles of dead dragon pin. What? Hmm. Mm. Turn, sir. Yeah, that's just my turn. Natural state of that's fine. It's still cool, but it's not frigid death like you were seeing bodies froze all over them instantly. Yum. Especially if you can help further now, we will see that the rest of the party has interrupted what looks like a priest that was praying into these halls. Right. Well, that is the extent of my movement. Continue forward. Onward. Apparently that's as far as I can get without dashing, so I guess I'll dash up a bit. And we will ascend a little, like there. Do you see a few fire giants kind of pointing and calling you, calling out that you are flying up, and that there's a dragon as well as a couple of giant people entering that don't look like giants at fucking all. And it's a tiny horseman. Dragon time. Way oh. Way oh. Way oh, way oh. Where is my queen? Shall I south one of the towers? Yes, start on the left, I'll follow. Start charging and get up the stairs towards this place. Yeah, I don't have the same move. And speed, please don't die. Simulate. Simulate, Kerm. Uh. But I'll check how far this spell goes first. Otherwise, it would make casting it kind of awkward. Uh, it is definitely not far enough. Yeah, 
That's that's definitely awkward. They're just out of range. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, uh, well, in that case, uh, you know, it's about time the simulator did something a little more useful. Uh, it will summon a shadow dragon. Uh, which, I need to check what the range on summoning it is. 120 feet, okay. You can summon it there then. I'll summon it right here. And the Shadow Dragon will be a, a, a frosty boy. And it will do a breath attack, which. It's these three. And that will be the Simulacrum's turn. Alrighty. In the sky. Oh, okay. It's going to move 30 feet. And then, we're going to, oh, wait, no. Uh, I have a question. What level chromatic bulb does my great axe cost? Cause we're gonna aim it at this boy. Uh, it should be fifth. Fifth? Okay, cause I think I didn't note that down. I just note that Thunder Wave is third. So chromatic orb is at fifth. Yeah. Okay, just gonna chromatic orb this boy. All the cold damage. Where'd I put it? Here. Full we'll pass. Oh. Uh, against him, though, into the side of his armor. Motherfuck, that's all I get. Does that count as me casting a spell if it's out of my great axe? Just asking if I can uh, bonus action Misty's step. It would not count towards your uh, action ability. You could still Misty step. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'll Misty step another 30 feet. And that's my turn. It's a pain in the ass. Knock, knock, open up the door, it's real with the now stop pop up the stainless steel. God damn! Oh, I'm all... ready, where the bitch is at? <laughs> you can just see them Everywhere. all panicking and pointing. <laughs> it's called <Gozira. laughs> You see a look on their faces like this is the stuff of nightmares that just walk through the fucking door. This is this is the, this is Ragnarok to them. Oh fuck! This is legitimately Ragnarok. <laughs> <laughs> all right, well, that is my action to dash. So continue. I can't keep up with all you fast boys. You teleport some shit. He's going to go greet Mr. Chicos. Sorry. How do you think the rest of the army feels with the fuck back? <laughs> 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 Yeah, I expected as much. Black Friday deals. <laughs> Fearing is going to try and minimize the amount of the fucking fire on the ship while the rest of the people fire the ship. Yikes. 
It's like some Nom flashbacks for them. Top of these towers, there are and now, as you can see, at the top top of each of the corner towers here, along with a few others, they're firing various cannons off at the Boreas Air Elemental, as well as off at Barrett's ship, and blowing quite a few holes in it. Hmm. Well, I'm currently transformed, which wasn't really my best idea, but I want to ask a question. Can I throw a dust of dryness with strength? <laughs> uh, well, let's hope I don't fuck it. So I'd like to fly slightly up the wall so then I can, like, see the tower. How high up is that? Uh, the top itself, lit. the top itself will sit a good 40 feet high. 40 feet? Yeah. Uh, so I'll fly like 45 feet up, so then I have an advantage point. I'd like to throw one of the dusts of dryness at it from my dragon arm. <laughs> uh, so you show me to roll like a ranged attack or something? Uh, go ahead and roll me a flat strike. Okay, yeah, that's reasonable. Uh, Aya! Well, I don't think I should have advantage for that, so it'd be the 11. Alrighty, so, well, it's not gonna hit directly on the tower. It'll be on the tower stairs. That's not as great. How many gallons? <laughs> um, I remember last time it was like 112,000 gallons. Alrighty, so, uh,. I'll go do the calculation again. Oh, uh, this is coming out of the gold. Square feet. Because <laughs> that's the high point. Can... As you can see, it divots down a little. Uh, I hate the volume was. Where is it? Volume calculation. Here we go. Fifteen feet. Fifteen feet. Fifteen feet. <laughs> It is 25,211 gallons. Holy shit. <laughs> God damn. You effectively just created a tsunami. Uh, well, I mean, <laughs> happy birthday. But for the non Americans, <laughs> that's about 80,000 liters. That's fucked. Nice. I have like 11 feet. Why would you do this? I was trying to knock him off the tower. I thought it would be cool. <laughs> I thought it would be cool to round everyone. <laughs> Alright, so uh, following the effects of the tsunami spell. <laughs> uh, <God. laughs> I can tell, Ralph, you're flying. Losses is too heavy to be pushed by this. So the. This is back! Oh my god. So, uh, Misty, uh, you, f you feel like Leviathan's with you for a moment as you see a massive eruption of water from the corner and you see Tailrath cackling maniacally now? as a dragon. <laughs> what, did, what did she do? I tried to throw Dust of Dryness at the tower and I missed. Oh. <laughs> Well, we at least we got water now. <laughs> You're off a Leviathan pool now. Alright, so, well, easy enough for Millie to make a strength save, as well as her simulator. I'm going to go ahead and roll Ballas. Uh, go ahead and roll your strength save while I roll the strength save. I mean, save. I'm in the air. Okay. Alright, well then, you don't have to worry about Ballas. is sadly on the ground, getting washed over by his friendly tide, tidal neighborhood. 
friendly neighborhood tidal wave. I only touch the ground when I need to chomp on something. You do see the other two fire dreadnoughts that are in the tower firing the ballista. It looked like extremely fucking surprised, and they're just kind of like lost in the matter of like, what the fuck was that? What else? You are immovable. You are fucking anchored, dude. Jesus Christ. Of course I would. Yes, <laughs> Ooh, above average. Mm -hmm. So he gets pushed into the wall there. Prone, screaming for dear life underwater. <laughs> well, considering all like all, all of us except for you know Miller and Hive Leviathan's mm. blessing, I mean this isn't really all that bad. This is good for us. Hell's yeah. <laughs> Dust of Dryness is my favorite fifth edition item. <laughs> it's so bullshit. It's great. wasn't crazy, but at the same time, they all rolled, like, below a fucking 13 for the ones that failed. Oof. That's good. Nope. Uh, a large portion of the field is flooded. <laughs> Other fire giants are looking around like, where the fuck did the water come from? I'm just like hanging onto the wall, laughing my ass off. <laughs> oh no, my toes are wet. <laughs> <laughs> you could like go prone and like crawl around in the water and be like Jaws. Will that be Um, I mean, I could drop down from the wall into the water for the hell of it, but no, I'll go back down a little bit lower so I don't get shot by the plus. And also the Berserkers, they gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> the fitness gram pacer test. <laughs> okay, they've moved. Just three. I moved all of them. I moved them 60. It doesn't look like much, does it? <laughs> no. No, it does not. Alrighty. Erupting from the forge. Forge? Yeah. Oh, what's that? The forge. Mm. We found who did. Ooh, ooh! Look at that! Oh, oh that's about, I thought to catch some dust to dry us. As he's really upset that his nest is now wet and fucking oh, hardening. Gonna start coming flying up to there. You hear the heavy beating of pyroclast wings. What the fuck? Raxiel is gonna help Monsieur Jiggles. Is there enough space for Rax to move through here? Yes, there. Okay, he's gonna drop down and fight Claw Claw. Uh, 18 and 26. Just in respect. Did you crack a cold one for the boys? I did what of it? The last of the frosty ones. I'm compelled. <laughs> the cold one compels you. <laughs> <laughs> yes. The armies. They approach. The 
down. Down the fucking hall to start being more defensive. Of them. How the fuck would we have done this without that Dow? They've been so helpful. <laughs> nice. Is AFK made a note that he would do some trick? On my yeah. turn, I hit the prone the guy. Doing some drilling really <laughs> quick. What the fuck? Just a drill. Executes this man. And Mr. Jiggles he doesn't like his tongue. It's gonna disintegrate a bitch. Look what they've done to my boy. <laughs> to see the grace with him. Why? The land of them. Oh, yeah. He, uh, he cleans up. <laughs> Say the line, Brad. Flash and fight turn. I cast invisibility. <laughs> ah, and you see a fire giant house filled with water. What? Hmm. Is it hot in there? Is the water steamy? Slowly getting to steam. Okay, so not like uh, unbearably hot. Okay. Like a nice summer. Just, just hot. All right. Hi. So we're close, and then an explosion of water. Yeah, I'm just gonna uh, uh, fly up a bit further. And I take the dodge action. <gasps> Possible. I simulate and will bonus action. Move this up to here. And hit the, these three with a frosty breath. And then, uh, for some main action. Still too far, but it can hit these two. It will shoot a fireball at these ones and alchemize it into uh, an ice ball. Oh, uh, fireball! Except it does cold damage. Frosting over and shit. Alrighty. Then you make a tackling. 
Uh, he's not gonna strike the boys, but he's gonna strike the boys day that they keep really and firing. Oh! Cool. Just the boys. Oh, okay. Nice man. She wants it for the shit. No. I don't want to take down Varric's ship. I blew up the other one. Gee. <laughs> you can't just do that. <laughs> Started the game by killing his ship, and I'm gonna end it that way. Fuck it, L. I'm crashing this plane. No, I, I have an idea. I've just got no idea if it's gonna work. <laughs> Uh, if I move to here, I can hit him, yeah, because five reach, cool. I smack a lot. <laughs> oh, yeah, they all have juices. Cool, cold damage only. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Look at that! Falls oh, that's hot! A solid block of ice and shatters on the ground. Nice. Um, is it physically possible for me to... Squeeze past the kelp. Yeah, you can literally. So I've only got 15 feet. <laughs> I only have 15 feet. I would end up ending my turn here. <laughs> That's fine. Okay. You just feel like horse butt against your leg. Yeah, it's fine. Can I offhandedly look at the ballista that they're using? Yes. Okay. What is it? And what is it firing? It is a fanciful and mythical fire rune giant ballista. He fires self-crafted fire bolts of the utmost finest craft in the kind. In other words, cool. And does it pivot? Own... Yeah. They, they basically generate their own fire bolus bolts. And it does more than just fire damage, right? Just fire damage. Just fire damage. So it's resistant to fire damage. Correct. Bummer. Pretty nasty fucking javelin and whipping it at us. Uh, was I supposed to take water damage from the suit? Uh, no, because you made your strike. Okay. Uh, so, that boy with a natural 20 miles with his fucking. It's a miss. <laughs> Is it fire based damage? It is not. This is just visceral metal. He looks at you like he's going to find someone I need to play for your non fight. And then the other three on the left is going to throw javelins at the front. This is 23 and 22 towards the right. Yeah, that'll hit. Um, was that a disadvantage? Um, it would not be a disadvantage for where they're at. I took the dot 
much action though. Alright, that's useful. 28 damage. Vicious black iron javelin finds its way into your eye. That sounds like an appropriate way to attack a dragon. up to the 60 feet and it can't really do much from here but but intensify Jesus Christ not that bitch bro doesn't do much damage but fuck machine Machine gun. He falls prone, but I find that of these boys. Uh, I hit. Him. Let's see. Jeez. Oh, you idiots! That's that's. I knock these bitches prone. <laughs> Imagine being a pirate class dragon, walks out, shot my little dart, knocked prone. Hey, what the fuck was. It's unfair. <laughs> what the fuck, man? What the fuck, man? Alright, that's me done. I can do, I can do no more. Damn these lengths not being long enough. <laughs> My plan worked. I slowed them down a little. to clap the illusion. It's an illusion. <laughs> he realizes something's up. Let's see real quick with that intelligence. Yeah, I was gonna say, they, they have to take an action to make an in check to see through the illusion. He thinks he missed. As, uh, Another uh, volleys are going up at Beard Ship real quick. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we just see another chunk of the hull fly away. Stay up there too long. Well, he'll get another volley off before the ship is officially fired. There we are. Let's push it further down at one of the turret towers.
eliminates that power entirely. Alright, let's put that freezing over in ass and exploding on the top. Arcane turrets start to shift. You can see that it's starting to peter out and go down a little bit, but trying to maintain enough flight. Boris is starting to come down at the other towers, but Arcane trying to keep them busy while you guys are fighting the main force in the front line. Well, it's a waste of a turn, but it was also probably stupid for me to do this in the first place, so I'll correct it now. I'll use my action to change back to Telrath. And then I'll bonus action activate the animated shield. And then, uh, you know, the, the other ritualistic part of my turn. Berserkers! <laughs> Walk 60 feet! <laughs> Oh no, those guys can't be in there. There we go. <laughs> Alrighty. They've been running <laughs> for like <laughs> five minutes. Oh, you're approaching me. <laughs> Extra scrap for the forges. We will see about that. Axiel is gonna have to catch up with everyone. Yeah. So he dashes. Uh, this black area here, is it like a wall? Or is that just part of the ground? Just marble. Okay, so... Step up over here. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna hit the boy in front. Oh my god. Two and a one. Wait, three and a one. Well, <laughs> the two hits. <laughs> wow. 27 damage. And because I'm annoyed that I missed, I'll put a hook in level one of that smile on there. Not gonna do much. Sure, take it, take it. And I will bonus action reapply my uh, divine shield because that guy did fucking 50 damage to me last time and I could not. Through the black riot, iron rock, well, dragon piercers, that's they are called. But right into it in your fucking chest for one of them. That is me turn. Mr. Jiggles. <laughs> he wiggles his way towards his front man. You feel a tendril wrap around you in the carpet for a moment. Okay.
That's a big dragon. That is a big dragon. <laughs> Jiggles boy you and ready for his fire breath. Now you're ready to die. <laughs> Thanks for seeing mm -hmm. uh, You're welcome. I knew you were be in the battle. <laughs> and now it's Brandmere's turn. Oh. Well, I didn't expect to be here. <sighs> mm. Welcome. Welcome to the jungle. I don't really want <laughs> a slight retreat. Um. Yeah, yeah. Everyone's rolling around in juggernaut armor. Brad is just trying to live, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Brad's just living his best life. <laughs> I got five fucking kids at Brad. home. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Red, just take care of these boys. It's fine. You got this. This tower is your tower. Go. Yeah, yeah, I can totally kill things. No, I yeah, can't. Go for bloodshed. You'll be fine. Why go I lick I this agree? one and kick this one in the nuts. Uh, like I should have brought my wife to protect me. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty scary, man. She's pregnant. That is scary. <laughs> Fuck it. Fierce. Fierce warrior. Agibada. Twice as scary. Mm -hmm. I really do not have a lot of plans. I will viciously mock the dragon. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he wasn't prepared. Yeah, okay. Uh, over the, the sounds of heavy combat in the room, the dragon will hear. Bitch. <laughs> you uh you see a little twitch in the eye. Who said that? No. It was me. I stopped being invisible. Go thirty feet this way. <laughs> <laughs> I will put Sanctuary on myself for a bonus action. Oh god, oh fuck, oh god, oh fuck, oh god. Just, why did I do that? Why did I do that? Why did I do that? I want to go home. Soon enough. Hi. Uh, I guess I'm just going to stop beating the crap out of this guy that's next to me. Yeah, eat him. Drop down. And. Bite. Claw. Claw. Uh, the bite will miss. Claws will hit. Okay. Oh, I also get to use Frightful Presence, so everything in 120 feet gets to make a wisdom save. Those are some pretty good-ass numbers. Mm -hmm. Well, it's a DC 21, so I don't know what their bonus is. <laughs> That's a shame. Following that, it is my simulacrum spell. 
Oh, my simulacrum. Can blast these guys. So, uh, oh, hang on, how far is. Alright, that one's out of range. Almost everyone to the left of me. Gets a good old. Hang on, I need to check if this has its own set DC since I'm using a staff for this. Oh, it's my spell save DC. Okay, in that case. Cone of Cold. Two of them looked like they didn't enjoy that too much, but the rest of them looked like they were able to weather worse before. Because I've walked in that room to the south before, at least once. Let's Fine. That is my collective turns. Say water damage, but you feel me? The cold one? <laughs> water damage. Pokemon! I got you. Oh! I want you to finish this man quickly, just crushing through shields, landing into his armor, and shattering him asunder. Hmm. Okay, now I come down and we do a little. little bitty walk away. <laughs> Giants. I was all scared. Good. No, sir. I don't like it. So. <laughs> I don't like it. Uh, Peace boy. He's going to try and smack that. He does not. Peace boy. They can make new saves at the end of their turns. Against who? Against you, Millie. Uh, and well, then it will hit. 25 pierce. And then the other boys on the stairs. I'll go for their good shit. You just do this. 21 and a 23 to hit. Or total. I mean, they'll hit. Of 55 piercing, and then the other boy, he's gonna uh, sidle along here to uh, come meet the iron fuck you bot. Hey, did he make a, uh, a wisdom save at the start of his turn? He was within 30 feet. Well, he would have that anyway, so he won't do that. <laughs> so, <laughs> he's like, mm -hmm. I don't want it. So he'll, he'll check. I chuck a, a spear at this mesh. Uh, and bounces off the arm. Just dunk. <coughs> and then. No, they all appear to Iron Colossi. Did 
Was he looking down at bread during my, my, my motion up to him? Oh, fuck it. Yeah. Oh. Well, in that case, as I run up to him, just one massive uppercut. Oh, that definitely is, jeez. Where do you think you're looking? Keep your eyes on me, beast. And I he's gonna get some fucking with this advantage of Eldritch turrets. Just, just. First one hits. And then, let's see. Uh, he try and well prone Mickey. It's the stop. Oh my god, he ran up and shoved him down, and now you're just stepping. <laughs> stepping on his fucking neck. Uh, let me see. Go in deep 10 more. God, the Colossus is fucking terrifying. He actually made DC. Um, <laughs> well, he takes terrifying. half damage, I think. No, I think he doesn't take any damage. No, he actually manages to roll out of the way. Oh, shit. Yeah, that makes sense, because he's, he's avoiding the stomp. If he got hit by it, he hey. definitely had to no matter what. <laughs> Your Come back here and take that leg of me. <laughs> Quick iron yeah, strike yeah. action surge. <laughs> I don't know if I can action surge in this thing. You can. Oh no! Oh, part of it. Oh. In that case, in that case, knock knock open up the door, it's real. He's prone, so let's give him the knock knock of the stainless steel. Jeez. <sighs> <sighs> Having a bad day. <laughs> okay, the two Eldritch Tarts at disadvantage. Oh my Ooh. god, the oh. Uh, well. oh, well, it's okay, another stop. Ah. Let's do it again. Uh, he did it again. Son of a bitch. <laughs> He lights that number in 27 quite a lot, apparently. He does. However, I imagine he's very unhappy. Oh, he's extremely pissed. I'll move one more slot up here. Because I just lay the beat down on this bar. Uh, well, he'll, he'll attempt an investigation on the, the dragon. Oh, look at that, he fails. <laughs> Even on a nat 20, he fails because he's got a minus one. Oh, oh it's oh, fine. He's so lucky because I forgot to make the dragon do something on my last turn. <laughs> so, Does that mean that it goes away? No, it just means I forgot to use it. <laughs> He's just smashing the illusion, thinking that he's winning. Yeah, it's, it's not fighting back. It's not it knows it giants are superior. I've stunned it! <laughs> the other dudes in the other oh, towels. Oh, the one's gonna keep firing Boris, the other one's gonna fire a fucking rear ship. Another turret, you can actually see some of the cannons fall out of the ship now. Oh shit. And then these boys, as they are, Neil the Dragons. Uh, one's going to try and melee fight in the in space. Uh, 
fire shield. Smack you, dragon face, knowing for 25 bludgeoning damage. The other boys bust up them nasty jams. Seven to hit your dragon. Is that these boys? Yep. Are they frightened of me? Or are they frightened? Oh, they're, they're, they're all frightened. <laughs> they're fucking throwing everything at fucking disadvantage, but also because. You pull me. It's fucking your time, dude. They don't want to fucking, fucking pull me. Any shit to fucking Warforge and dragons that uh, they don't fucking <laughs> own. Oh, man. It's time to kick ass. I don't know if Rossi was there for all that. Um, I mean, I heard a lot of numbers. I don't know which ones are damaged, but I heard uh, high numbers, which are probably hits. 55 total of uh, piercing damage. One was the sh a shield slapping in the face, you know, with a javelin. Okay, I know I took the first one. Right. 30 damage. Okay. okay. Oh, no. Crunch. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to like crash the wreckage. <laughs> Especially since the main front gate wall is not there. More can people just, can come in. Can I just break through that wall there? Mm -hmm. Yeah! <laughs> oh. Oh, yes, oh. the Oh, this is about to be... They're about to go, ay 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 Is that a nice dragon? <laughs> Oh, you don't understand. It's a nice dragon. Oh, that's yeah. good. I was hoping for one of these. Yeah. <laughs> he likes peace, eating humanoid flesh, tea. Humanoid hey, I've got flesh. humanoid flesh. <laughs> hey, I like tea too. See, now you've got a lot in common. <laughs> Smiling one. I don't boy. like the big smile. How oh, why? Stop smiling. Oh, no, I yeah. Keys. Mr. Krabs. Ah! <laughs> Alright. I will. That's the Warforce Glosses sheet. I need the Tell Wrath sheet. Excuse me. I will realize that I never refreshed my spells for the day, so I'll do that right now. Because I'm good at this game, I swear. Uh-huh. Okay. Now I'm gonna go double check what spell slot that ability is. Okay, okay. That's a four. Okay, then I will cast Guardian of Nature on myself as a bonus action. Um, then I will shoot this boy. My lightning bow. Uh, let's see. Yeah, this one. Two. Oh my god. Telrath is always good with one shot. The one shot that pierces the eye. Sunday is a good portion of the 
and then I will drop down again a little bit so I don't get ballisted in the face. If it's taking down a ship, it probably isn't too good for my skin. <laughs> All right. And then I will let my... Uh, what? Berserkers. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, here we go. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. Okay. Oh, God. Okay, really? Go back to the main hole. Oh. Why? This bird is not always cracked up to be. <laughs> Everybody else has tales of such glory. Some bullshit, dude. <laughs> They've been sprinting the entire time. They gotta earn their glory through running. <laughs> The fitness gram pacer test is a yeah. multi stage aerobic capacity. <laughs> Alright, so. The soft lift of its wings, fast feather beat. It flies up very quickly to be glorious. Get actually get viciously bonked early, or did he make that save? Oh, he got viciously bonked early. Alright! <laughs> <laughs> Bitch! <laughs> Bitch! This is ringing in his mind. Yeah, I was gonna say, I don't know how much of the benefits the simulacrum has. It is meant to be a copy of me, so it's... It does not have your soul, though. That's fair. And Barry's all about that song. <laughs> Barry's about that thing. Goddamn. A fat fucking fire breath of dexterity check of 23 is in order for... Warforged, the Magicalicrum, and the Rest of the boys here are under you fire. This does uh, not count as a magical effect, so my magic resistance doesn't come into play, I'm assuming. So let's do this. Actually, wait, what'd you say? What was it 21 to save? Uh, 23. Okay. Hey, well, I can't save against that with the machine. Yes, you can. <laughs> How? Oh, with inspiration. I, with inspiration. Oh, only I roll pretty high with the inspiration. Eight. I did roll and need to roll an eight slash oh one d twelve. Oh, hey. made it. There you go. Half damage. So, pivoting just enough where you don't get full blasted in the front here. Kind of cut it with your side. Get the shield down into the ground. Just... <laughs> oh, we're going to take 52 fire damage. And that is a lot of fucking sixes in that shit. Holy crap. My 
Go on. Right there is. Oh. oh, yeah. So, which, uh, He may be. Nice fail. Hmm. <laughs> uh, he's got a shield of faith to concentrate on. I don't think he's gonna be holding that. I can do it. It's um. Way too fucking high. Uh no. He took he took half damage because he's a tiefling, so half of fifty one is a twenty six DC or something, which was possible. Got breathed on for like a hundred damage. Would have been fifty. I was say, he's still fire resistant. Yeah, unless he made the save, in which case he can't. No, he failed. You're all day fifty. Yep. Oh. Damn. How much health is he missing? He's a beefy boy. Understandable. Have a nice day. Max, yeah. It's a big, really fucking scary ancient boy here. I mean, it's not that much bigger than he is. <laughs> does have a 26 d6 breath weapon. Token size, maybe not. He still falls with the gargantuan class. Yeah, I was gonna say, uh, I don't really know what Raxio would do in this situation. <laughs> Probably not want to fuck with the giant ancient boy who just uh, roasted a half of a fucking. You know what? He can come back me up. Oh. Cool. Damn, oh, that's yes. quite the backup. And... No mercy. I have been backed up. think I'm invisible. No, but he just wants to make sure he's following you on the field. Okay, yeah. Oops. Dragons in the huge E. <laughs> they got that E peen, bro. <laughs> themselves to uh, the rest of the crew. Hi, I'm George. Hi, Gary. Alrighty. Mr. Jiggles!
It's electric. That's perfect. Oh, that's hot. Looks like he went AFK half an hour. <laughs> yeah. He is away on Discord. Yeah. I can't believe you've done this. I shall set to go further away. <laughs> Run to hide under Misky's spine. Okay, as I pass Misky, I'm gonna slap her on the shoulder and go, Tag, you're invisible. I cast greater invisibility. Why? And you can also have inspiration. Why? Bye. <laughs> As she fades into the ethereal. Uh, no. You're nuts. <laughs> Don't happen to have haste. Hi. <laughs> uh. You know what? I am a special kind of stupid. Uh -oh. I'm gonna do a little fly over and come down next to the dragon. Uh oh. Nice. Because I like fucking with dragons. You like fucking dragons. Oh my god. The 33 and the 34 definitely hit. 21 does not. That is all. But they can definitely throw shit at you. That sounds like it'll hit, just at a guess, you know? For 65 damage to 11. And then the 
other ones are going to throw shit at this one. And all this horrific. A 14, a 12, and a fucking 15. I zoomed out to see how big the map was and how much one I covered. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, we've come so far! You really have. Uh, I mean, people have range attacks to do that. I was thinking of staring at everything everyone else is doing. <laughs> get to the end of this turn and we'll cut it off for the night and kill it to get to that time. <laughs> Easy. Well then I'll just We're dash you. halfway there. Everyone's <laughs> done. Oh, yeah. yeah, that's right. Let's run it late. Come on, boys. What? Hey, welcome right. back. Hey, you did killed I, some boys. Did I die? Caught the end. You took some damage. But that was mostly from a really high fucking DC-23 check for getting roasted. And you lost your shield. What? Shield. Oh, that's a big phase. Oh, it's like my shield! What? It, <laughs> yes, it fucking even. melted, dude! Magic uh, melted! <laughs> I assume fire breath, somebody calculated the fact that I'm a tiefling. Yes. Yep. Got you, babe. Yeah, my mum decided it was a good time for me to become Bob the fucking build. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. Did you fix it? No, he didn't. But he tried. Sorry. Ah, fuck. Took forever. But you did kill fucking two fire giants, actually. Yeah. Hmm. You see, I magically gained the ability to attack three times. Shh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, my god is with me. I can suddenly attack three times a turn. <laughs> uh, no. And you only dash up the game? Yeah, I don't want to action search until I desperately need to, and he can't see me anyway. Uh, he has no clue you're there, but he's still gonna throw some shit. Miss horribly? The other dude's gonna try and fucking. Uh, Fire shield him. Uh, a 25 and a 20 to hit Raxiel. Should be able to try Raxiel will aerial acrobatics the 20. Alright, so only one will hit for 23 bludgeoning and 6 fire. 29 damage. And the other guy up top will. Yetus Deletus, another spear, but towards the forge of the bosses now that he sees it's not. He sees an opportunity. Fuck, knock open up the door, it's real. No, the opportunity's gone. Throw it. <laughs> it's gone now. It's just gone. <laughs> just blink. Iron claws. What's this? I have an advantage. <sighs> oh, no, run up the door, it's true. <laughs> yep. <laughs> now we got the Eldritch Giants knocked that bitch burn. Whoa! Smack! Smack! Fuck a trick, Jesus Christ! Well, oh, what's the matter, buddy? You wanna, you wanna get fucked? Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! A bit. So it doesn't get curb stomped. One of three. Uh, bitch A. <laughs> You're in the end game, boys. There's legendary creatures everywhere. Ooh, okay. <laughs> it's okay, we got one of our own. It's the Colossus. It's true. And our other dragons. They can roll around with technically fucking five right now. <laughs> yeah. Alrighty. Uh, and we will call it there and pick up next week.
the rush. Nothing oh, like four right. hours of combat. Fuck yeah. <laughs> four, hours, four hours of sprinting. Yeah. Four hours of face test. Oh god. Did they catch up? Oh no. No, they're still running. They're almost there. I think yeah, they can keep up with us and we all move at like double their speed. Another Some six are still running. I don't move at double anyone's speed. I got teleported twice. Yeah. Do you die? <laughs> I mean, in dragon form, I can move 240 feet a turn, so. Okay. I yeah. have yeah. This yeah. dragon boy cannot be looking good right now. <laughs> A curb stomped him t three times now. I can tell you, he is not bloody yet. He is not bloody. Oh, oh fuck. Okay. I mean, it's a dragon working at Jotunheim. I don't really think it's gonna be a bitch. <laughs> well, oh, Punched and shot and dodges curb stomps. Is he still giving me the stick? Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah it's, like, it's like locked up on to you no matter what. <laughs> you called him a bitch, man. <laughs> you called him a bitch. Dragons are frightful. To yourself, mate. Yeah, I mean, especially the burning. Your brain was as big as your ego. <laughs> oh, 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 you're coming. You're coming fast. <laughs> You got that comment too. Throw all right up your ass. <laughs> Snake, where are you? I'm inside the dragon's ass. Ah! I'd like to use Wish to cast a plane shift. I'm out. <laughs> I'm going home, Sorry. guys. Fuck you. <laughs> We're supposed to be giants, not fucking giants. No, no. Brad's like, I'd like, I'd like to use Wish. I wish I had never said bitch. <laughs> I wish he succeeded on saving through. I, I wish to take back the things I've said. <laughs> I like, go, go walk oh, up to him and just edit his memory. Say right you're his friend. <laughs> Modify his memory. Oh yeah, that'll work. <laughs> I'm your close friend. We banter like that all the time. Just modify it like, dude, I was saying how awesome that attack was. Oh yeah, fuck it all. I was yeah, saying like it was <laughs> bitch and I was bitch and yeah. This bitch, yeah. You modify his memory. Do you you really think it's cool that there's a robot uprising? So you're like gonna help us? You've always been pro robot, but you've always been afraid to say it. You've never <laughs> seen a robot this big, and now that you've seen one, you love it. <laughs> I mean, once you guys get through these guys, you only got cloud giants, storm, storm, storm and, storm. and then whatever else is at the end. Some and whatever else is at the end. A fucking ice cream shop of giant. Mm. <laughs> oh, hells yeah. Okay, so like, there's... Oh, oh, shit. There's one room, and then there's another room, and then this is where we're gonna get the ice cream. Yeah, yeah, uh, we gotta... Uh, next, next we gotta fight the Neapolitan fucking ice cream giants. Mm, yes. You're just lucky I didn't actually color. include all the giants in the Orkney. Ah! Damn. Can I just say, like, I really like Neapolitan ice cream. I feel like it's so much of, yeah. Like, no, no, it's, it's good, but avoid the middle. Hey, don't like the middle my the favorite no, one, no one eats the pea. <laughs> I love yeah. all parts of Neapolitan. Eat. The strawberry ice cream is fucking great. Yes, yeah. Neapolitan English. All ice cream sucks. Brought to you by Lactose Gang. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you go sit outside with your... Yeah, you're not involved in this conversation. Okay. They're icy poles. Oh, Zupa yeah. Dupas. As if the ale Brought to you by Zupa Dupa gang. Bitch. Who, who would, who would win? Who would win a biological creature evolved over billions of years? Millions of years, whatever. And... Or one, or, or one milky boy. <laughs> Imagine being defeated by yogurt. <laughs> Josh, I can't wait to see this entire time up unfurled. I want to see what all the side rooms look like. It's so cool. I will gladly show the color you scheme and everything. The yeah. Oh, hell's yeah. Once it's all done, it's like, it already looks cool from here. No. No, <laughs> fuck off. <laughs> yeah. Alright, all right, guys. How many fucking nice things you can collect from Jotunheim. Okay, I activate my uh, my ability to pass without a trace, so I'm literally undetectable with like a 40 to my stealth, and I'm just gonna start sneaking around and stealing everything. 
Just throw it in the hole. With my ability of hide in plain sight, they literally cannot spot me as I loot their <laughs> shit. <laughs> Sir, we've lost all of our gold statues. What the fuck? What do you mean? Just think <laughs> Steve in the background with the gold statue walking crouching. <laughs> right next to them. <laughs> yep. I don't know, sir. I think they're crouching. That's impossible. No one can do that. We'd be able to spot him, surely. Oh no, not sir. Not not with the most recent game upgrades. If somebody's crouching, they become very hard to spot. Also, sir, why are you naked? <laughs> I swear you were wearing full armor just a moment ago. Don't worry about it. Is that your hand in my ass, soldier? I knew you were gay. <laughs> How did he get here? Oh, this bottle of poison appeared in my pocket. Better drink it. How could you do that? You can sneak an entire mine into somebody's pocket. Just like in Fallout. <laughs> an entire blend of mine. <laughs> they don't feel like a oh, When you said mine, I was like. Like an underground cave. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, I kind of feel like that one's better. Just slide an entire mine into somebody's pocket, like, mm, I've had to really mine in your back pocket. Ooh. Oh, there's a mine shaft in there. Wow, what a smell. Is that mine yeah, shaft? You keep, oh, God, are you happy mine. to see me? You keep hearing that fucking Minecraft audio cue, where it's like, because it's an abandoned mine shaft me. <laughs> And then some cave spiders crawl out of your eye. No. <laughs> no. They're crawling out of my ass! My ass! It's in your ass! <laughs> it's in your ass! <laughs> Zombie! Zombie! Alright, it's time for dinner, and then are we all good to reconvene later for bonus D&D? &D? Yes. Huzzah! All right, anyways, a fun session. Uh, thank you, Josh. Yeah, excellent, excellent. Yeah. Excellent, oh, excellent commanding week. Captain Bird. You boys have a nice evening. Good Captain chill. Bird is captaining out. See you.